Hello dear subscribers and unsubscribers, welcome back, my name is Kabir from Visual Cube. In this tutorial I'm gonna show you how to destroy concrete inside of Blender. But not like this guy. But before we start creating things inside of Blender, don't forget to click that subscribe button. So right now, let's jump in Blender. Okay guys, to create that destroyed concrete, the first thing what we're gonna do is we're gonna add a cube over here. So. Shift A to add and add cube. So I'm going to move it up a little bit to snap to grid. So I think I got it perfectly there. All right. So I'm going to go in edit mode and G select this face, this top face and move it to Z axis. Okay. Move it up like this, make it big. All right. So the next step is to add the one more cube. So shift A, add more, one more cube, scale it down. And I'm gonna move it over here. Let me see somewhere, or some something like that. Okay, move it over here, and we can also scale it down a little bit more, and scale it on Z axis like this. Okay, and I'm gonna go G and Shift Z to lock the Z axis to just move on X and Y. All right, put it there. Move it up a little bit. All right. Okay, when we make the position for this new cube, which we are created, we're gonna go in edit mode and add a subdivide or subdivision, subdivide it uh, one time and go here in modifiers and select the subdivision surface. And over here, we're gonna add two subdivisions and apply it. Okay, go from edit mode to object mode and apply that subdivision surface. Okay, and also right click and shade smooth. All right, so we are created this first part over here, but we need to create the hole inside of this concrete. Okay, to create the hole inside of this concrete, we need to add a displacement to this, this object over here, this shape. Okay, so we're gonna go in modifiers, add and go here in displace. And right now, as you can see, we are created this shape bigger, but we need a little bit noisy displacement on this on this object so we're going to do that by creating new texture so add a new texture and right now we have this a little little cube created with this uh, weird edges to get rid of these things we're going to go and create our own texture inside of the texture properties so over here uh texture properties and I'm gonna change the type of this texture from image or movie to mass curve. So as you can see right now, we have this this uh, noisy displacement map added to this object. And you can see that something is happening. All right. So we can always change the size. We can, we can change the something around. If you want to find some better results, you can always go there and change something to to make it to make it realistic all right to make a hole inside of this concrete over here we're gonna go in modifiers and select this big concrete here or this big cube and add the boolean tool and in boolean tool we're gonna select this object over here so as you can see, there is nothing happening over here, but to see that, go over here inside of this, uh, select first this cube over here, or this object, and select the, go inside of the object properties and go in viewport display. And in viewport display, we're gonna change from texture to bounds. And right now, as you can see, we have the hole inside of this, inside of this cube, or so-called the uh, concrete. So we can change the size of this of this object here. So we can move it over here, change it, make it bigger. And you can always go back inside of these uh, textures and make a different textures if you want to change something inside of this inside of this hole. But for right now, as you can see, everything is okay. And also don't forget to apply this displacement. And when you apply it, apply and also apply it Boolean. And right now we can go and delete this, this uh, 
object or this shape and we have our concrete destroyed concrete created so guys this is my final result of the concrete which we are created before so you can always spend some more more extra time to create some details inside so i created this uh this metal metal bars over here i created the the cracks inside of this inside of this uh concrete and i added some rocks down here as a detail as well all right guys that is it for this tutorial if this was helpful click that subscribe button like this video share this video with your friends and see you in the next week in your tutorial